So eels come from the Sargasso Sea, we think, but nobody has ever seen a mature adult eel inside that supposed spawning ground until Dr. Roz Wright decided that she wanted to solve this mystery. The problem is that every time you try and put a GPS track on an eel, it'll either slither free of it or it will take so long to get to the spawning ground that the battery on the GPS tracker will die long before it gets there. The closest researchers had ever got was one single eel that had got as far as the Azores, the coast of Portugal. And so one year, Roz decides hey, why don't I take my holiday there? And instead of sunning myself on beaches, I'm gonna spend my time talking to all the locals about whether they've seen any eels. She sets up this project, it's called Eel Trek. And uh, in 2020, they caught and tagged 23 silver eels in the Azores and then they sent them off and then they waited. And like before, these slippery eels, loads of them managed to shake off their trackers, loads of the batteries dies, all sorts of high drama, but then, five eels were tracked to the very edge of the Sargasso Sea. And Roz has the data for one eel that went inside the spawning ground. I'll accept that this, this might not sound like it's big news, but in the world of eel tracking, this is, this is a very, very big deal. We finally have proof that at the very least, the adults go to the Sargasso Sea. Still have no idea what they're doing when they get there, but you know, that's the next step of the mystery.